At Divergent Microfactories, we've built the first 3D printed, fully functional supercar. The car that we're using right now has less than one third of the environmental damage that a, say, 85 kilowatt hour electric car uh, would generate. Using structural connectors to design and build cars radically reduces that material and energy input needed to manufacture. We call our core technology a node. So this is 3D printed out of metal. So the way that it works is you use fine metal powder and a laser, and the laser actually is controlled by a computer and melts the aluminum exactly where you need the final material to be. The node is a structural connector that connects aerospace carbon fiber tubing into a larger complex structure like a uh, car chassis. There are car chassis that can use upwards of a thousand pounds of metal in their construction. That metal comes from a roll, gets stamped and welded together. Our car is using uh, a total of 61 pounds of aluminum and 41 pounds of carbon fiber. So the total weight of the chassis structure is 102 pounds. Over time, we'll be able to radically drive down the price of the structural connectors. You'll be able to, to design and build that entire chassis or the entire chassis for a pickup truck for under $2,000. How we make things is much more important than how we fuel them and whether they have a tailpipe or not. 80 to 90 percent or more of the damage, the environmental damage and health damage that comes from cars comes from the manufacturing, not from the tailpipe uh, emissions. We've got to rethink how we manufacture because when we go from 2 billion cars today to 6 billion cars in a couple of decades, if we don't do that, we're going to destroy the planet.